uh, muddy spirituality. This spirituality, to understand spirituality, it's simply the part of us that is unseen. Anything that's part of a human, and every human being does it. It's not like some people are spiritual or have spirituality and other people don't. Every human being has a spirit. Every human being is engaged in uh, spirituality. The question is, what is that life, that inner life, that unseen life? And you can almost always see the unseen spiritual life come out in a person's physical life as well. When we talk about muddy spirituality, it's, we're not talking about dirty or impure. That's not what we're talking about. In this series, muddy spirituality is the interplay between our unseen life and our very seen life, or our spiritual life and our physical life. And why is this important? Uh, well, following Jesus in this world and in this culture is difficult. I mean, do you agree? It's not easy. And um, when, we, when we don't understand or when we kind of live differently than what we're going to be talking about, we can make following Jesus exceptionally more difficult than it needs to be. If you embrace and kind of understand what we'll be talking about in this muddy spirituality series, you're going to be following Jesus, and things will begin to make more sense on why things in your life are such, or even understanding yourself, right? As we grow closer to Jesus, he tells us more and more about himself and ourselves. There are parts of our lives, parts of every person that is recognizable. We have different parts, and what we do is we separate those parts. So when it comes to the unseen and the seen, we, we separate out that inner person and we think about it differently than we think about our outer person. We think about our unseen, you know, inner life and our outseen, out in the world, physical life. And what we're going to be suggesting today is that God doesn't see us that way. God sees us as we are. You are an individual you are a person who he has created. Muddy spirituality is about that, how as God sees our, all the parts of us that are recognizably different, but he sees them as one whole, we too can see ourselves as a whole person. And as we follow Jesus, it's all of us that is following Christ. 